To have a nice moth and butterfly collection like this one, we have to start by relaxing your specimen. For that, you will need a relaxing jar. Your relaxing jar can be glass or plastic. Inside, place a piece of wet cotton, put your specimen inside for 24 to 48 hours. After that period of time, your insect will be ready for pin and mount. Now we are ready to start pinning our butterfly or moth. What you need is your spreading boards. There's two types of those, the fixed one and the adjustable one. I prefer to use the adjustable one. You will also need some pins. Again, number two or three is what we recommend. You will need your pinning block, your forceps, wax paper that I already pre-cut here for our demonstration and some scissors. And with that, we're ready to start pinning our moth. For the demonstration, we will be using the adjustable spreading board. So grab your insect. Remember that always the pin go through the second thoracic segment. So carefully put the pin through that segment. Have your pinning block next to you and push the insect through the pin, place your insect next to the fixed side of this adjustable board and press. You may need to use your forceps to do that. In the meantime, carefully lift the wing and close the adjustable side and close. Moths and butterflies have veins on the wings and the vein that runs through the edge of the first pair of wings is very strong. So that's when, where you want to pull carefully the wings from. Don't be afraid to break it, but pull carefully. So pull slowly. Oh, that was beautiful. The first pair of wings the base of the first pair of wings have to be perpendicular to the length of the body of the insect and the second pair of wings have to go underneath the first one have your wax paper ready and use extra pins to hold that wing. Follow the same procedure for the other side or for the other pair of wing. Get them from the strong vein, pull it, the second pair underneath, beautiful, your wax paper underneath. and pin that side. If you have several moths or butterflies, start from the top and then you can walk your way through the bottom. Um, leave your butterfly on the spreading board for at least 48 hours before you move your specimen to your collection box. Mm -hmm.